let's go. We share a very popular opinion and we agree on a very unpopular opinion, but probably not for the same reason. We both chose red and we both hate green. Now reasons may overlap, but there are some differences. Let me explain. The popular opinion. Red is correct and really should be the only option, but that's because I'm basing it on the narrative, basing it on not just what my shepherd would do, but what yours should do too. I'm basing it because the arguments for control and synthesis were not well done, well presented. The foreshadowing was non-existent or just left a lot to be desired. So to pick any of these options would... Amanda? So to pick from any of these options would be random. We did it. Derail the story. Betray everything that came before. Yes. Forcing a narrative with limited premise. We did. And I know it's your story and your decision. I'm... But this is not how you write a story. This is not how you tell a story. Proud of you. So how about we just discount blue and green? For now. And if you followed the story and chose red like most of us did, then congratulations. You destroyed the reapers and damned every organic in the process. Because the cycle continues. There's no room for speculation here. The catalyst is right. The cycle continues. And I know you want to disagree, but who are you? Who are you to dispute data accumulated over hundreds of thousands of years? Data factoring every organic being that succumbed to the cycle, countless civilizations. Who are you to dispute facts? Uh, now you lost me. I disagree. We actually have evidence this isn't the case. Shepard brought the quarries and the gets together, proving a synthetic versus organic problem can be resolved. Because your shepherd brought the quarries and the geth together. Because your shepherd did this. Exactly. That was only 36% of you. That's abysmal. We're gonna gamble all organic life, hundreds of billions to trillions of lives in the near future on 36%. 36%. I know you want to believe the reapers and the catalysts just don't understand organics and this situation, but they do. But let me level with you for a second. Let's focus on the 36% of you that got this right. There's nothing to suggest in 20, 50, 80 or 300 years that another war won't happen between the geth and any other organic for whatever reason. The same way you couldn't guarantee or confirm the hero Krogans of the Rachni Wars would become the villains 620 years later in the Krogan rebellions. The same way you can't confirm another species wouldn't create more sentient life. The Yark, Vulture, Batarians, Turians maybe, or our very own Rachni. Or how about someone new? We don't even need to go that far. I mean, what's Edie and the potential? What's Sam? What's the ancient AI in Andromeda? Am I correct that it's within your power to vent the station's atmosphere and kill the organisms aboard? Do you hear those words? My programming would only permit that under the most extreme conditions. Exactly what would those conditions be? Why do you wish to know? No reason. So the conclusion is pretty simple. Within that 36%, the likelihood of the cycle continuing the war between the organics versus synthetics is extremely Okay, happy. okay, okay. So destroy is the only ending that makes sense from a narrative point of view. But destroy would also lead to the inevitable destruction of all organics. How about the unpopular opinion? What if the inconsistencies with the other endings were addressed? I'm talking about control and synthesis. Breadcrumbs laid out properly. What ending would make the most sense? Well, let me ask you a question. Is fusion not preferable to subjugation? Is merging not preferable to destruction? Synthesis is the right option. 
You see, I don't actually believe that synthesis necessarily stops all wars, but it does stop this war, the creator versus the created. It stops you from ceasing to exist. Will you actually care once it's happened? Will your descendants care? Will they all seek to become organics again or sentient? You might say yes, but I don't think so. At least these images say otherwise. I know this is a controversial take simply because I'm telling you what's right and wrong, right? But I hope I laid out some reasons as to why I came to this conclusion. You could disagree with me. If you find holes in my argument, that's perfectly fine. Just let me know. And maybe I'll do one of those YouTube I was wrong about this, you know, opinion or whatever. I doubt it though. <laughs> Until next time. Shout out to the boys and girls in the comments section.